Hi there and welcome back to the Champions of Kryn. I'm Baron. In the last video we created our party, so we can begin adventuring now. And we get the copy protection. What is about 5 of journal entry 1? Journal page 26. Oh, I have to look that up. Um... So it's twenty six five one. The point is actually I I tire of always looking that up in the manual. So I actually created a uh, an Excel sheet where I'm writing the solutions down. Twenty six five one. I didn't have that one yet. So let's take a look. It should be 2651. The. Well, that's easy. The. What the fuck? 2651 is not the. That's weird. Let's erase that. Um, 26. Oh no, it was the other way around. It was one uh, entry, f entry one, word five. It should have been one, two, three, four. We probably ah shit. Ah, let's let's delete that. Goodbye. Okay. Twenty six three seven twenty six. I, I I also don't have that shit. Okay, twenty six three seven um one, two, three, four, five, six, seven should be S. Journal page 26, let's double check that. Entry 3, word 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Yeah, let's try S. It is correct. <coughs> okay. At the inn of the last home in Solace, a brave band gathers in preparation for a grim journey. The lands reconquered from the dragon armies are to be scoured of the last vestiges of evil. Joining you on the trip is an older knight of the Rose. He is introduced as Sir Karl Galtzen. His mission is to evaluate the outposts for the Council of Knights. That's good news, so the Council of Knights did react to the letter. That is, you know, printed in the journal. Once the company is organized, you begin the journey to the outpost. The party travels through Salamnia and arrives near Throttle. You are escorted to see the commandant. Sir Carl greets you at the office. The commandant and I are discussing some important issues. Your first mission is to patrol Throttle and report any suspicious activities immediately. Sir Carl continues and you re record it in journal entry 51. Uh, General Entry 51. Oh yeah, here it is. The worst mon monsters our scouts have reported anywhere in the area are hobgoblins. Draconians and evil dragons have long since abandoned this area to our forces. Still be a little wary on your way to throttle. Also be sure to report back here immediately if anything unusual or dangerous occurs. This outpost depends on, on information brought back by patrols such as yours. Good luck and may Paladine watch over you. Thank you. Also buy and ready equipment from the armory. Memory spell memorize spells before going out. Sure thing. So let's go to the armory and pool the money. And take a look at Rekal Dorian. Because she now has a damage uh, 1d2 plus 3, that's because she's unarmed. And she's the only character that actually came with equipment. 
she has a plate mail, a shield and a long sword. Now she does a 1d8 plus 3 because uh, she has a long sword equipped and verse plate mail and a shield so her armor class has been reduced to minus 2. Very well. The rest of the party sadly is unequipped so we buy some armor, a shield, a long sword and a mace as a secondary weapon for you. You should also get a mace as a secondary weapon. Thank you. Sylvia Saint, being a cleric, gets a ring mail, two maces, a shield, and a staff sling. Thank you. Zara White, being a mage, gets a quarter staff. Genevieve Jolie gets a quarter staff as well. And Kobe Tai, being a candle thief, gets a hoop pack. That is the trademark weapon of all the candles. <coughs> they get a bonus when they use that. A hoop pack is a ranged and a melee weapon at the same time. Very useful. Since she is a cleric thief, she could wear ring mail, but then she wouldn't be able to use the thief's ability like abilities like backstabbing. So I'm gonna give her leather mail. And that's actually it. Maybe we should buy a second two pack. Okay, how much money do we have? Nine. Oh, that's not really much. So we buy one, two, three, four, five for you. And one, two, three, four. And that's the end. Okay. Get equipped. Twenty dots. <laughs> That's nothing. Oh well, can't be helped. She only has sixteen. And we're good to go. So, um, we should go probably maybe to the, the bar and relax. You hear Tavern Tale 40. Okay, what does it say? Don't drink the beer, the barten bartender washes his feet in it. Okay, then let's not drink it. Let's relax some more. You hear Tavern Tale 23. Um, it's been too quiet for too long. Something's got to happen soon. I hope not. You hear Tavern Tale 17. A young woman has her eye for Sir Carl. It makes him uncomfortable. Nothing's been seen in Throttle for months. This place is boring. Good. No news are good news. Oh, and that's all the Tavern Tales apparently we can get. So we leave. And go to the inn. Because we still have to get some spells. A uh, record during being a knight of the first level can't cast spells. Later she will be able. But Sylvia Saint, being a cleric can learn a few. She gets a special spell because she's a cleric of um, Magia, if I'm not totally wrong. And uh, she gets, what does she get? Detect magic and two cure light wounds. Thank you, that's it. Zara White's being a white mage. Oh yeah. So she gets two uh, spells, take a sleep and a magic missile, and then she gets two bonus spells, because the white moon is full, actually. If uh, there's a white moon, Sarah White will act as sh if she would be, if she was a level, if sh as if she was a mage that is one level higher than she actually is, and she gets two bonus spells. You only get the bonus spells if you are 
are quite intelligent. I think you need more than 15 or 16 in intelligence. And she even keeps those spells if the moon is like a new moon. She keeps the bonus spells until she uses them. Although at the new moon she would act as a level below her actually level. Uh, that's rather unfortunate but can't be helped. So yeah, you keep those spells even through the other phases of the moon. But if you would rest at the new moon you wouldn't be able to get the bonus spells again. So it kind of makes sense for a mage to rest when his moon is full and if you have to battle evil mages you should battle them when the black moon is at the new moon but it's difficult to time and I wouldn't really rest for a week or anything just to get the moons to the right phase. That sucks. And it's the same with Genevieve Jolie but it's the red moon that counts him. And Kobe Tai being a mag uh, what is she? A uh, Mishaka cleric. She gets her three special spells and the Dictatic Magic and Cure Light Wounds. Okay, memorize those spells and rest. You have to rest for 5 hours and 30 minutes. <coughs> Very well, we save and don't quit. Instead, we leave. No, I won't, don't want to enter, I just left. As you top a rise, you spot a caravan under attack. Draconians have already massacred the men and are now slaughtering the women and children. They pause when they see you, then rush to attack. Um, okay. You um, delay. You delay. You move to this spot. Done. And God. You delay. You move. Gotta be kidding me. The tree is in the way. God. God. Okay. Let's take a look around. So there are a few draconians here. Sylvia Saint is a little hurt. Not too much though. That's cool. So you move down here. Take a look around. Yeah, I think we're good. So you cast a spell, a sleep spell. Here. That works nicely. And you move around too. Can you attack somebody? You could attack him, and since that bars recording is asleep, it's helpless. You don't do anything right now, you attack this one. Where did he come from? Well, he came from up north. Oh, there's another one here, see? Fine, you yell. That's a good thing. It kind of has the ability to yell. 
if he does that he sort of insults the enemies and then they really take off take off and um, they want to kill the candor and they focus on attacking the candor and they get a, a malus to their attacks as well so it's quite a good thing you delay you delay on guard okay um you no you don't do anything right now you should cast the sleep spell you have to right and the draconian is asleep who would have thought fine move ahead and slay him exit aim manually thank you I think we are victorious now is that correct yes it is and each character receives 108 experience points oh well I thought I was about to sneeze but apparently I'm not um what can we get? 20 steel units, that's good. We take them. And always be careful that the knight doesn't have the steel. You will see soon why. <coughs> oh, all of the draconians are slain save one who rips a book from a dead man's hands. He turns to you and merely laughs, then he takes a step and disappears. One of the surviving women comes up. Brave warriors, will you help us reach the outpost? All of our men have died. Do you help? Sure. Thank you for your help. And Rekaldorian gives her tithe to the knighthood. Yeah, good thing she didn't have any money, so she can't give it away. Let's go to the commandant. You enter the office to the sounds of battle. Sir Karl drives his sword through the commandant who collapses. The body then writhes and becomes a sivak. Sakal murmurs, I was afraid of this. You report. His face grows grey. This is much worse than we feared. We have a patrol on throttle. Caramon leads it. Find him and tell him he is desperately needed here. The imposter has emptied this outpost of troops. I know you are inexperienced, but I have no one else to send. Awesome! Let's go to the bar and relax some more. Right, we hear more tavern tales apparently. <laughs> Draconians have been seen near throttle. Things are heating up. No shit, Sherlock. The Draconians were lit by an auric. They are very deadly. Even giants are being seen near the outpost. Glad we have some rangers and dwarves in the company. Throttle is starting to crawl with monsters. Some of our scouts have been harassed. Oh no, they have been harassed. Okay, and that's the end of the Tavern Tales apparently. So we should go to the inn again, uh, because we used a few spells, first of all you should use our cleric spells to fix the party. And uh, you should memorize your sleep spell again. As should you. So we rest. Get our spells back, save, and don't quit. So we have 20 gold coins. That's uh, probably enough to buy some... First we pull the money of course and then we buy some more darts. No. Buy. Thank you.
out of money. And we have 60. That's a little better. Let's leave. And return to throttle. This time we actually enter. Throttles off limits to you. Leave and no one gets hurt. What do you do? We attack. Okay, let the fun begin. How about Genevieve Jolie casts another sleep spell? delay you cast another sleep spell in here okay let's start slaying You delay. Is anybody helpless here? No. Then you delay too. I hate you. Okay, who is hurt? Sylvia Saint. They always attack the cleric. You are helpless. You are helpless. You are not helpless. And you are not helpless either. Fine. You cast... No. You cast a sleep spell. Here. Oh, wha it didn't work on one. I think uh, Genevieve actually already used her. Okay. You are not helpless. All of those are not helpless either. Okay, let's take a look around. Who is still awake? You are awake and those are awake. So, um, how about you cast a sleep spell in here? So you move here. No, I think it's okay to be here. And you cast a magic missile on him. You also cast a magic missile on him. What can you do? Attack. Um, maybe you, you, oh damn it. You heal yourself.
Um, you should also cast the cure light wounds on Silicent. Okay. <laughs> Duh. Thank you. Aim. Cast magic missile. Cast magic missile. The problem is this guy will probably surrender before I can kill him. Shit. And if he surrenders I don't get his XP. Ah, well can't be helped. But at least we have won the battle. Hello. Fine God, for fuck's sake. Let me out. Excuse me. Is this a bug? I'm not getting out of that. Oh no. There was a where was the last hobgoblin that surrendered? Fine. I don't care. So um what do we get here? Oh we actually get scale mail. Fine, we take that. Scale mail is better than ring mail if I'm not really wrong. Armor class of three. Armor class of two. Good. Take everything. Overloaded. Overloaded. Okay, how about we leave? Really leave? No, and return to uh, the outpost. Rakodarin doesn't have any money. So we can sell that. Zero steel, that's not really much. Okay. Oh, now I get six steel pieces for a broadsword. No to self, don't take shields. Okay, 
Let's buy a short bow then and 100 arrows. The same goes for you. And we buy a few more darts for you. No change here. Ooh, I have a lot of money. <coughs> Let's buy a few more dots then. Okay. Take the money. And return to the inn. And now I uh, see um, the red moon is not full anymore. So that means... Wait a second. Sylvia Saint is a white mage. No, actually not. It's a cleric. Da -da. Get your cure light wound spell back, girl. <coughs> Sarah White is the white mage. So the white moon still is full. Uh, so she gets all her spells. Including the bonus spells. That was actually a mistake. But Genevieve Jolie now, because it's uh, like an, a waxing moon, I guess, so she only gets her regular spells. No bonus spells for her. And Kobe Tai also gets her Cure Light Wood spell back. Okay, let's try something now. Let's see whether we can actually uh, raise a character level. So you go to the hall and train your characters. Kobe Tai. She will can become a level 3 thief. She has 18 hit points now. And now she has 22. Let's save that and exit. And we get a copy protection again, 29, 16, 2. That would be plan, I think. That's correct. If we train her again, this time she only got 21 HP. So there is a random effect here. Uh, that uh, determines, well, there's a dice roll involved here and that tells you how much HP you get. I don't really know how that works with multi-class characters, so between the videos I will save and reload a few times to see how many hit points Kobe Tai can get. I, I can do the maths with single-class characters, 
But with multi-class, I don't really know. It, the manual says it averages it, but uh, it doesn't tell me actually how it it's averaging the hit points dice roll. So yeah, this will be the end of this video. I thank you very much for watching, and the next video, Kobita will be a level three thief and have a few more hit points. So thank you very much for watching, and see you soon. Bye.